Let's now talk about Jata Grasso, episode 12. Uh, quite a riveting episode, but uh, I I is it worth watching again? Let's find out. Pace! Yung pacing niya, uh, slow, pe pero tense. Uh, it's a it's a rare combination when it comes to um uh, when it comes to pacing. Yung slow pero tense, kasi um uh, pa lang, uh, opening sequence pa lang. Mahalata mo na ano eh, mukha may gagawin si Nasok ko dito eh. Uh, mukha may gagawin ng prinsipi rito. Uh, kaya bigla na siya nagpakita sa Cherry Blossom Palace. Do I have complaints guys? Absolutely none. You would you would not expect anything less uh, from uh, from a political drama anime like Yatagarasu. Ganitong ganito kasi ang mga political animes. Uh, talagang slow uh, pero tense but not uh, but not excruciating. It really kept me to the edge of my seat from start to finish because uh, of the slow and tense pacing of this episode. I thought for uh, for 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 even two seconds, na, uy, next week na pala finale. Pero na realize ko, nope, hindi pa pala. 20 episodes nga pala ang run dito. Overall, guys, no one has the right to complain about the pacing of this episode. Okay? Uh, pang political drama siya talaga. Flow naman! First gear shift was when Nasuki Hiko started uh, uh, interviewing the, 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 his, po his potential uh, his potential brides. No brainer right there. Kasi um, you'll, you'll already figure out right there and then Kung paano ang magiging takbo ng episode na to. Kung paano magiging... Uh, kung paano... Kung gano'ng ka-tense ang magiging pacing nito. Right here in this gear shift. Second gear shift. Uh, well... I would call this a gear shift. I don't know about you guys. Kasumi uh, suddenly... Uh, suddenly shows up and explains himself. Akala nga natin lang, patay na to eh. Pero, uh, through this gear shift, you would totally understand that um, that, if, uh, that if a person in this anime uh, assumes raven form, uh, they're, all, uh, they're all the same. Magkakapareho sila. And besides, guys, bakit naman bababayahan ni Nasukihi ko yun? Alright? Simulat sa pool pa lang, tauhan niya yun. Okay? Simulat sa pool pa lang. And, uh, from the get-go, alam na ni Nasuki ko kung ano ang relasyon between Kasumi and, uh, and Shiratama. As proven here in this episode. Final gear ship was when Maso uh, suddenly cut her hair in front of in front of the, in front of the prince. She probably found the prince's inquiry into her emancipating because uh, right there and then na nagets na ni, ni Maso na hindi siya ang pipiliin ng prinsipe so right there and then so as a sign of uh, acknowledging uh, acknowledging Nasukiko's uh, Nasukiko's IQ Kinupita na niya sarili niya. And, if it weren't for this gear ship, uh, we, we would not be set up for, for Nasukiko's final inquiry, final inquiry, of course, on, uh, of course, on Asibi. Na mukha may tinatago rin baho, despite her innocent looks. Pero guys, would it be enough for you to totally appreciate this episode? With just these three gear shifts? Ah, ah. If I have to say this, um, ROTW in and ROTW out, I would do it. Because right now, there are a lot of normies in this world. So, 
if you would, if you want to totally appreciate an anime episode, watch it from start to finish. Yun lang po gagawin ninyo. Huwag po kayong tamarin. Plotwise. I'll drink to that first. <clears throat> there were a bunch of explainer sequences, pero wag nyo. These were um, these were legit ones. Therefore, malilis ang plot, guys. I mean, come on. Uh, with an episode as riveting as this, hindi nyo maglalagay ang pilo ng side story or backstory dito. E di sira ang momentum. Sira ang, sira ang momentum ng bida. Probably, with everybody having short attention spans these days, they would stop watching the episode once, uh, once na maramdaman na there, there will be a side story or backstory involved. Nope. And, if, if you've seen the episode already, guys, you might have seen uh, explainer sequences that would be deemed as backstories. Nope, guys. You're making a bad. You're making a big mistake. These could not be judged as backstories, but explainers. All right, they are pure explainers, which are very vital to this episode. Kaya napakalinis ng plot, guys. Superbly clean plot, and you would require nothing less for this kind of an episode. Malaking bagay ang ginawa ito, ang ginawang ito ni Ninaso Kihiko. Which would, uh, which would be a factor in how this anime will now run uh, in the next 8 episodes. Of course, leading up to the finale. Overall guys, superbly clean plot. Ines! Ang linis! So, base flow and plot all came together and... I just can't wait uh, on how Nasukiko will end this expose of this. Pero, if, but, but if this continues, who will be his wife now? <laughs>